China, the world's second largest economy, has been investing billions of dollars into its military run space program, aiming to close the gap and catch up with the United States and Russia in space exploration. In a historic move, China is now all set to send its first civilian astronaut into space as part of a crewed Shenzhou 16 mission to the Tiangong Space Station on Tuesday, the country's manned space agency said. Until now, all Chinese astronauts sent to space have been members of the People's Liberation Army. Gui Haichao, a payload expert and professor at Beijing University of Aeronautics and Astronautics, has been selected as the first civilian astronaut. Gui will play a crucial role in the on-orbit operation of space science experimental payloads. The mission will be headed by Commander Jing Haiping, who will visit space for the fourth time. Zhu Yangzhu will serve as the flight engineer. The three-membered crew will take off from the Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center in Northwest China. Gui will be mainly responsible for the on-orbit operation of space science experimental payloads, Lin said. Hai Chao is 36 years old and is a professor of spacecraft dynamics and control at Bihang University. He is also the first payload expert to visit the space station. Gui received his bachelor's and PhD degrees in aerospace engineering from Bihang University in 2009 and 2014, respectively. He then got admitted to York University. Hai Chao's university said that he hails from an ordinary family in Western Yunnan province. In a social media post, the university said Hai Chao first felt the attraction of aerospace listening to the news of China's first man in space, Yang Levy, on campus radio in 2003. Gui is set to take off on board the Shengzhou 16 spacecraft from the Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center in northwest China on Tuesday at 9.31 am local time. The final module of the T-shaped Tiangong, whose name means heavily placed, had successfully docked with the core structure last year. Once finished, Tiangong is expected to remain in low Earth orbit at between 400 and 450 kilometers above the planet for at least 10 years, realizing an ambition to maintain a long-term human presence in space. Under the leadership of President Xi Jinping, China's space dream has gained significant momentum. The nation has set its sights on ambitious goals, including building a base on the moon. The National Space Administration has announced plans for a crewed lunar mission by 2029. China's Tiangong Space Station is a vital component of its space program. Equipped with cutting-edge scientific equipment, including the world's first space-based cold atomic clock system, Tiangong will foster scientific research and technological testing. It is expected to remain in low Earth orbit for at least a decade, hosting rotating teams of three astronauts, conducting experiments and contributing to China's long-term human presence in space. While China does not intend to engage in global cooperation on the scale of the International Space Station, the country has expressed openness to foreign collaborations. The extent and nature of such collaboration, however, remains uncertain. China has been excluded from the International Space Station since 2011, when the United States imposed a ban on NASA's engagement with the country. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.